Welcome back to Mama Needs a Goal. Thank you so much for joining me today. And if you're new here, welcome. So friends, we are now on week five of our 52 week realistic declutter challenge. So I am here in my boy's bathroom, which also serves as a guest bathroom as well. And I am going to be decluttering underneath their sink. Um, I have not looked in there yet. I do know years ago I put some decor in there, I think, and I don't think I've ever taken it out, um, but I have no idea what we're going to find in here. Um, I brought two trash bags up, um, so we're going to basically just get in there. Um, I'm going to take, I have four drawers and two cabinet doors because it is a double sink, so each sink um, has two drawers and a regular door on it. Um, I'm going to take one at a time. I'm just going to declutter and get rid of stuff that's no more good or if there's stuff that needs to go in a different place, I will um, put it to the side and then put it in a different place and then I'm going to tackle each drawer separately. I'm not pulling everything out because if the boys need to get in here later today and I have everything drug out, I'm doing one at a time. This is what, why I call it a realistic challenge because we're not pulling every single thing out. We are gonna take five, 10, 15 minutes a day. You have the entire week to do this small challenge and just dive into it. So let me stop rambling. Let's get the camera turned down and try to decide how I wanna do this. Do I wanna take this one cabinet at a time or do I wanna open everything and give you guys a quick view and then tackle one at a time? Not sure, but let's get started. All right, my friends, I'm sitting on the floor. It's a little hard because it's not a lot of space between the wall here, as you can see. So, <laughs> here we go. All right, this is underneath the one sink. What do you got in here? All right. Okay, not too, too bad. This big thing, I don't, is that a dehumidifier? I think that's the, yeah. All right, that's not too bad. Alright, let's check out the bottom drawer. What do we have? Alright. Alright. Not horrific. Not horrific. Alright, let's check out this top drawer. Oh my, it's popping out. Okay. Looks like this is the drawer that gets used the most. Hmm. Okay, <laughs> oh, let's move down here a little bit. All right, let's see what's in this one. Oh my, well, well, apparently at some point I must have bought baskets to organize down there. And that never happened. <laughs> I, I honestly don't remember purchasing them. That's hysterical. Where are they from? Okay, we'll deal with that later. I'm curious where I got those from. And then here, let's see. Ooh, we're pretty full. Well, the travel kit takes up a lot of space, so it might not be too, too bad. We'll have to see. I don't know if you guys realize I'm a little nervous here opening these drawers. <laughs> Not knowing what we're gonna find. <laughs> oh, lordy, lordy. Yeah, I think. Yeah, I think we got quite a bit going on in here. Yeah, we got a lot of decluttering to do, friends. So 
Let me get the camera situated so we can start tackling this one at a time. All right, my friends, I'm going to tackle this drawer first, and then we're gonna figure out what we're doing. So I have some trash bags, so I have some that's gonna be trash, and if there's anything in here that can be donated, I will go ahead and donate it. I honestly, I know I had some decor I put in one of these cabinets. I didn't see it right off the bat. So maybe I did get rid of it. I don't know. We'll find out. But like I said, we're going to tackle one drawer at a time because I know at some point I'm going to stop and get dinner ready if the kids need to get in the bathroom. I don't want this bathroom to be filled up with all the stuff in this drawer. I don't want to get the boys' stuff mixed out up because one side belongs to one, one side belongs to the other. And I don't want to mix their um, things up. So I'm doing it one drawer at a time. Realistic decluttering. And um, anything that I'm going to keep, I'll just, you know, set on the floor right here. Stuff I'm throwing away, put it in, and anything donating. I am not worrying about selling anything because I find if I want to sell it, I hold on to it, and then I never sell it. All right, so let's start. This is full, so we need to keep that. This is the travel bag. Yeah. Um... <laughs> Yeah, when he was little, he used to like to look at Lego books. <laughs> so we're going to recycle this. So it looks like I needed a pile for trash, recycle, and donate. All right, so there we go. Donate pile, or it's recycle pile. Oh my, I remember buying these. Remember I said about the decor? Um, these are going to go in the donate pile, and then this, I'm not quite sure what this is, uh, this is, um, a razor, okay, alright, well that wasn't too bad, so we're going to put the razor back in there, this is going in here, I'm going to go ahead and put these all back in, I'm not organizing yet, friends. I'm just decluttering and getting rid of the stuff that I know is no good. And then I will come back when I have time, now that I know what I have in here. So, I have an idea of what's in there now. Now we're going to get ahead. Oh, I got to put this back in. Alright, so that drawer is decluttered. And I know, put my little things in my donate bag. All right, I just realized I put the water pick up on the top there. I'm gonna put this back in here. Now we're gonna go ahead and hit this drawer. All right, extra toothbrushes. They should be in the closet there. It's got a fingernail kit. We got a little trial size shampoo we're going to throw in there for now. And if I end up with too many, we'll deal with it. Alright. Alright, it's wiped out. I'm just going to throw the baskets that I have back in here real quick. I do know he does not use this. So I'm going to trash that, this is my trash bag, donate bag, trash bag. Um, I have this little basket in here and I'm just going to go ahead and throw any razor stuff in there for now until I'm ready to declutter or uh, organize. <clears throat> He's got this little set here. I'm just going to take all the plastic off. Kind of sit that in there for now. <clears throat> it has this little basket here. It looks like oh, here's another 
Butter. Let's get rid of some of this. This is from when he had his braces. He doesn't need that anymore. Oh, I'm sure these are expired. 2018. Um, good Lord, 2012. Whew! You know what? These are all expired. They need to go in the trash. these back now I'm gonna get, I'm gonna get rid of those what am I saying all right so that's decluttered I'm gonna go through them real quick and make sure there's nothing there that my other son can use these are gonna go in the closet his old um, not old but his um, electric toothbrush is gonna go in the closet because he doesn't use that anymore and then I'm gonna dump the flossers on the thing that's on top of the uh, sink that I have a little container I keep them in all right, my friends, I finished two drawers. Um, I'm not quite sure how long it took me. <clears throat> I have all this stuff. I did clean these out. There were a couple like um, some flossers and a little travel toothbrush that was in here that I kept and put it in their travel container. Um, but I'm gonna take all this stuff down and put it in the recycling bin. I've got two drawers cleaned out. And I have two cabinets and two drawers left to do. It is dinner time, so I'm gonna go take care of that. And the nice thing is, I don't have everything drug out, so if my son needs to come in here and use the bathroom, I don't have to worry about everything being out. Um, and then what I'll do is after dinner, come back up and I'll finish filming and show you how I clean out the rest. I may not get it done today, I don't know. Um, I may end up picking back up tomorrow, but the wonderful thing is, is we have all week to do it. So friends, I will catch back up with you in just a few. All right, my friends, I am back. Dinner is done, and I'm going to tackle the rest of this. I have time to do it, Now I'm going to get it knocked out. Um, it's not much in the other ones, so hopefully I should be able to get it done quickly. If you notice, I tackled the worst first to get it out of the way. So let's go ahead and start tackling the rest. All right. That is funny. I do not remember buying these baskets. Did I get them at the dollar store? Yep, I bought them at the dollar store. They're, I don't remember. They're actually nice baskets. Interesting. All right, well, here's the box for his water pick. Another hair dryer. This is a heavy one. All right, what else we have in here? Ugh. Some wipes. Oh, they're still, I haven't used these in ages in here. Sponge and cup. Yeah. I definitely I don't need that, so I'll donate that. Well, that's obviously dried out. That can go in the recycle bin. Oh my goodness, here's the decor that I was talking about. It's no good, it's all broken. <laughs> it was a sailboat. <laughs> we'll throw that away. And then, have a little soap pump and donate that. All right, and that's it that's under there, my friend. Now, since I know um, we have this box, I'm going to go ahead and put his um, thing in here. So we'll keep this all together. Alright, 
I'm gonna put that in there. I'm gonna go ahead and throw these in the back just to get them out of the way. This hair dryer is an old one. And this I do believe is what he uses. I'm gonna just throw that back in there and that quick, that is done. Yay. Yay, yay, yay. This is our trash bag. These are the, I got these, are no good, so I'm going to get rid of those. This will throw in the recycle bin. All right, let's move over to the next section. Oh, you know what? This needs to go. Oh, the trash. Alright friends, there's not much in here. I like this candle. How how long do you think this candle was was in there? <laughs> oh my gosh. I couldn't tell you the last I bet this is ten years old. I couldn't tell you the last time I bought a candle. That's hysterical. I am just tossing that bad boy. Oh uh, we have him here. Okay, we do have some razor stuff in there. I'll just hold on to that and get and then we have these sterile bandages but the box and all is pretty nasty and I think I'm just gonna go ahead and get rid of these just because yeah they're pretty old and yeah they're nasty they're going all right and we got a pair of scissors which I don't know if he needs that for something a razor, yeah, razor protector, so we'll hold on to that. <clears throat> and some just trash. I don't know, these are, I don't think, yeah, they are good. They're wet, so I'll hold on to those. All right, that's it for that drawer, friends. Now let's move on to the next one. All right, and we got contact lens stuff. Oh, I don't know if these are different eyes or what. Go back in. I'm gonna wipe that dry. Oh shoot! Before I put anything back in. <clears throat> All right, my friends. Let's wipe out. I'm gonna put this back in, and I'm gonna put his loose um, what you call it's back in here. Thing I have left to do is knock out the stuff in this cupboard. All right, my friends, I'm trying to give you the best view I can in this little bathroom. So here we just have a travel kit. All right, my friends. 
friends, so that's pretty much all that was in here was this here and um, the travel case and these couple little things here. So that's a good thing. I'll add a little bag to that. So I am just going to put this back in here. I am actually going to take that to my mother because I think she might be able to use it. So there we go. Woo! That was hard in this little bathroom. All right, my friends, so that'll do it for today's video. I really hope you enjoyed it. As I said, it was a challenge in the small little bathroom, getting down there and trying to get the right angle so you guys could see me um, going through the drawers and decluttering it and see what was in there. As I mentioned before, take one drawer at a time. You don't have to do everything at one time, just one at a time. You saw how quickly I had um, a bunch of stuff that needed to be recycled. I just picked it up after I finished one or two of the drawers, took it down to the recycling bin to give myself a little bit of space to work. I did stop, take a break. We had dinner, came back. I had time to finish it this evening, so I did finish it. But the nice thing about it is you didn't pull everything out. So if you didn't have time after dinner to finish it, you can come back another day because you have the whole week. And that's why I like decluttering this way. We're not organizing. We're just decluttering. Now we know what we have left in the drawers. We can think about how we want to organize it um, and then go forward with organizing at a later date. But our goal right now is to just declutter. So friends, thanks again. I really appreciate it. If you haven't already subscribed to my channel, please consider subscribing as it does greatly help me out. Please don't forget to hit that little bell because it will notify you every time I have a new video coming out. And don't forget, check me out on Facebook and Instagram. So friends, thanks again, and I'll see you next time. Bye.